All right, let's talk about number 49. You're given an equation here, which you're asked to write in slope-intercept form. And in order to be able to do this, you need to remember that slope-intercept form, which you learned in Algebra 1 and used a little bit in geometry last year, is y equals mx plus b, where m is the slope and b is the y-intercept. Now, sometimes you'll be given information about a line and asked to write the equation, and sometimes you'll be given an equation and asked to manipulate it so it's in the right form. This is one of those latter ones. You're trying to manipulate an equation you're already given and get it in the right form. So to notice, the, to notice what we have to do, we have to notice two things about the slope-intercept form. First of all, the y is by itself, which we already have that in this equation, so we don't have to make any work for that. The other is that the x is in a term by itself with a coefficient, and the b, just a constant, is in a term by itself. So if you look at our equation, that's not the case. We have 2x plus 7 on top of 14. We need to split that up. So what I'm going to do here is take the 2x plus 7 over 14 and divide each of the things on top by 14. So basically breaking it up into two fractions. Now I can simplify each of those fractions. 2 over 14 goes to 1x over 7. And then 7 over 14 is 1 over 2. But remember, the x in slope-intercept form isn't like a part of the m. It's beside it. So I'm going to write this as 1 over 7 times x, technically over 1, but I don't need to write that, plus 1 half. And the slope is 1 7 of this line, the y-intercept is 0, 1 half. That's all you have to do.